I'm going to try filming from my phone again. We all know this didn't go so well last time, but I'm going to give it a try because this is just a quick unboxing video. This box is from Peace Hill Press, which is the Well-Trained Mind Company. They actually sent me these things to review. Um, so I got them for free in exchange for my honest review. I can already tell you that I do know that I love a lot of these products because I've used them previously with my now 16 year old stepdaughter. And so a lot of them are just things that we've already used and I'm gonna use again with my kindergartner, but they were nice enough to send us some new copies since the copies we have are very old and very well loved. And so this is just a quick unboxing of what we got in our box. I'm gonna move it this way so I can not show my address. There we go. So in here is a bunch of paper wrapped things. So we got the first language lessons for the well-trained mind and this is the audio companion for levels one and two. I did not use the audio companion last time I used this program. I just had the book that I got used off of eBay. Um, but I think it would be nice to have and we do plan on using it through level two at least so it will be nice to have that. Next is the audio companion for the ordinary parents guide to teaching reading. This I also didn't have last time, I just had the book. So, be nice little extra to have. And then we have The Story of the World. I have an ebook version of this, and that's what I used previously, but I really wanted a hardback version this time around since my son does have autism, and for him, just holding the book is a lot easier. And so I thought it'd be nice, and I prefer the hardback because I do have another kid after him who's gonna use it, and my kids can be a little rough on paperbacks. Next is the first language lessons level one. And when I had it before, it was when it was still the older edition when one and two were combined into one. So it'll be nice to have um, a newer copy where it's just one. Um, typically this program is for considered first grade but they do show that you can use it in kindergarten, and I think that my kindergartner is ready for it, so we're going to go ahead and give it a try. And the next is the Ordinary Parent's Guide, excuse the kitty litter, I'm in my kitchen and that just is the only place stored at the moment. The Ordinary Parent's Guide to Teaching Reading, and I've also used this before, I've actually used this to teach three other children to read. So I plan on using it again this time to teach my now five-year-old. Um, how to read. He does know his phonics sounds already, so it'll be a little easy in the beginning, but I think he'll enjoy it. And then this is what I was looking forward to the most. Is, oh, that. There's the activity book as well. This is the Story of the World activity book. Um, I have the audio book already, so I didn't ask for the audio book. I just got the activity book to go with it. Um, which will be fun because my son loves to have things to do, so we'll enjoy using that as well. Now this is what I was saying. I was going to look forward to. This is actually the accessories for the, well, the Ordinary Parents Guide to Teaching Reading. I did not have these last time either, and um, I think that this will help a lot. So this has all of the flashcards, which is like the volume cards and phonetic sound cards. There's a dry erase board, if I can get it out of here, um, to practice writing the sounds on, as well as these, which are the magnetic letters, which I think will be a great addition to the program for my son. I think he'll really enjoy having these, um, so this will be fun. And it comes with... 144 uppercase and lowercase tiles. So, well, that was everything in the box. And I will, of course, show you guys how we use it as we are using it, as well as when it comes time, give a review at the end of the program. Like I said, we have used it before um, multiple times. Um, and so I know that I do love it. Um, so it'll be more showing you guys or telling you guys how it works for a child who has special needs because we have not previously had a child with special needs to homeschool. So 
that is everything. If you like this video, go ahead and subscribe down below for more homeschool videos. Thank you.